Chess has become a way of life for these avid players. The fourth annual Francis Cardisco Memorial Chess Championship drew about a dozen men from across the state this weekend to compete for a $1,000 prize. Competitors say although it doesn't sound or look like much is going on when you're watching, they say the players are actually burning calories from thinking so hard and are also learning skills that will help them succeed outside of this weekend's tournament. It helps you with your concentration, it helps you make decisions, mm -hmm. and it helps you to realize that actions have consequences, both good and bad. Chess in the grammar schools is what really should happen a, a lot more, and uh, it, it engages um, the mind in, in ways different, differently than, uh, say, computer games. Cordisco's Corner Store hosts monthly tournaments. There will be another. It's an age-old game, and one local man wants to bring its popularity back to the area. John Cardisco hosted the fourth annual Broome County Chess Championship this weekend at Cardisco's Chess Center in Binghamton. About a dozen chess enthusiasts joined the tournament, vying for a piece of the prize money, a trophy, and, of course, bragging rights. This year, David Gogan took first in the open section, and Daniel Dudley took first in the reserve section. Cardisco, who actually grabbed second in the reserve section, says chess is more than just a game. If you're a player, it, it's it's hard to describe. It's uh, there's a quote that I use all the time that if you think chess is just a game, you're not playing it right. Cardisco holds the tournament each year in memory of his brother Francis Cardisco. He hopes to bring back the love of chess to the Southern Tier, where it once thrived in the '70s during the Bobby Fischer glory days. If you think chess is just a game, you're not playing it right. And uh, it is for the players. It's not just a game. A, a game is monopoly. A game is, uh, you know. Scrabble, a game is, you know, any video game. This is much different. In fact, a lot of world-class players actually call it a sport. Mm -hmm. And they have Olympiad every two years from around the world. It's, it's, quite, it's quite the deal. It's, it's huge. I wish it was bigger in this area, but we're going to try to change that. Just a few reasons why John Cordisco started the Broome County Chess Championship nearly four years ago. Players got together in Binghamton to compete for a big trophy and prize at Cordisco's Chess Center on Shenango Street Saturday. When you're playing chess on, a, on tournament day, you forget about everything else in life, and all you worry about is 32 pieces and 64 squares. Games run through Sunday with nearly a dozen people competing this weekend. There are two categories, open and reserve, for players of different skill levels. Many hope championships like these will bring more people to the game. There are now ways to play that are kind of high-tech on the Internet, but, but it's really a, a very old game, and I, I don't know why it, it doesn't. I, I think we just need someone like Fisher to give chess a shot in the arm. For the younger people, I think that's a great thing because they really have to think, and you know, when they're on Facebook or they're playing their video games, and it just becomes second nature, but this really makes them think. But the event means more to Core Disco than just handing out trophies. Every year, he holds it in honor of his brother Francis, keeping his memory alive. My youngest brother, he wasn't a chess player, he was a hockey goalie, he was a good one too, but he passed away a couple of years ago. My parents were pretty emotional when I first did it, and uh, his two boys, my nephews, you know, they know about it, and uh, they really appreciate it. It's pretty cool. It's just something that I do, uh, you know, to honor him. It's sad in a way, but it also isn't, too, that it's, he still carries on. Building blocks of a tradition that means so much to so many in the southern tier, and one that Cordisco hopes will make chess big again. In Binghamton, Elise Michelanis.